Okay, so I've been putting quite a big focus on trading bots this year, and I gotta say I have gotten pretty good at it. And lately I have been using trading bots for days when I don't feel like trading myself, and they have been extremely profitable for me. So much so that I have actually opened multiple trade bots across multiple different platforms, and like 80% of them have been very profitable for me. I mean like 3-10% to per day profitable. And that's insane because if you think about it, that's way more than average professional trader makes per day. So you might be asking, what's the catch here? Why is a simple trading bot more profitable than a professional trader? And the answer is quite simple. First, they don't get tired. Second, there's no emotion involved. And third, they're comfortable with making hundreds of these little small trades every single day. And these small little trades add up to quite a huge number over time. And how it works is simple. As you can see in this graph right here, as the price is going up and down, up and down, the bot is actually making multiple buys as the price is going down, and when it starts going back up, it starts to sell off. This is something called grid trading and it's quite popular among trading bots, and it's actually using a principle called DCA or dollar cost averaging, where you're continuously buying or selling an asset to in the end have bought or sold at the best possible price when you average it out. But anyways, enough about the theory, let me show you how some of my bots have been doing lately. So if you watched my previous videos, you probably know that one of my favorite places to run trading bots is Binance.com because it allows huge number of grid with relatively small investment and that's not a thing that many other platforms allow simply because the fees would actually eat up most of your profits if you were to exercise these small trades but anyways on Binance the fees are so low that it actually makes sense. And as you can see, I have two bots running right here, both on 20x leverage. The first one is BNB slash USDT pair, and over a two day period it has generated only 1%. But one of my favorite pairs to run is AVAX BUSD, and as you can see, over the last two days it has generated 13% or $20. And the initial investment for both of these bots is $150. And as I mentioned before, these bots run on leverage and that's not an awesome thing to do because that increases your risk of liquidation and as a beginner you don't want to get liquidated. So I wouldn't actually suggest Binance as the first place to open your first trading bots. Instead what I would recommend is Bybit. It's much simpler and the profits are nearly the same without the leverage. On top of that, if you use the link in my description, you can get a sign up bonus of up to $4,000. To access trading bots on Bybit, all you have to do is go to trade. And now, before you even create your own bot, you are prompted with these other people's bots that have been running successfully. What I like to do is go to 7 day ranking. And as you can see, there are a couple of bots running more than 30 days with 1600% APR, which means that these guys on average are making about 5% per day on their initial investment, which is really good. And as you can see in the 7 day ranking, most of these bots have been running for a significant amount of time. This one right here has been running for 40 days and has generated 1300% APR. So now there are two ways that you can create the bot on Bybit. You can click this button right here to create your own bot but now you would have to enter parameters, number of grids, select the price range that you want your bot to trade in. And as a beginner, I realize this is something that you might not be comfortable with doing. So what I recommend you do is go back, go back to seven day ranking right over here, scroll back and find the bot that has been running for the most amount of time. Uh, in this case, that would be this bot right here, which has been running for 40 days and generated over 1300% APR and what you can do now is actually just copy it and what it will do now is actually copy the settings from that bot that has been running successfully for over a month and it will actually copy the parameters over to your own bot so you're essentially cloning a successful trading bot now in this window it will prompt you what your minimal investment would be so if we assume that this bot is making about 5% per day we shouldn't be too far from the truth since it's making over 1300% per day year if we wanted to make $50 per day we needed to invest about $500 in this trading bot. Now I don't recommend that you start with such significant amount of money and that is because past performance of trading bot doesn't guarantee that it will generate profits in the future you have to remember this. So what I would recommend for you as a beginner for example, you have maybe $200 budget or something like that. So what I would do is go ahead and add $70 in one bot, create it, then go back, 
look for other successful bots maybe in different pairs for example xrp usdt this bot has generated close to 2000 percent apr and has been running for eight days uh, it looks decent enough so we would copy this as you can see it copies all the parameters over to your clone then you will enter another 70 dollars in this bot create it then go back again search for some other bot i see that plenty of people are using mana slash usdt bots so what i would do is go ahead and copy the most successful one and it looks like it's this one which has been running for 10 days and generated over 2000 percent apr go ahead and copy it again and enter your last 70 dollars create now and what you would have now is three bots with a budget of 210 dollars and you had three separate bots running three separate pairs and generate your profit every single day. And the reason why it's so important to spread your investment across multiple bots is to minimize risk. Because if one of those three bots that we created is not as profitable as we want it to be, we can always just shut it down and enter the money in different pair. Now my personal favorite strategy with trading bots is to let them run for exactly one week then close them down, collect profits, and then spread that profits across new trading bots. And by doing that, I'm actually gathering fresh parameters every single week with every new bot I create and thus increasing my profits. Because the chances are, if parameters were working like a week ago, you could always improve by selecting new parameters for the next week, thus improving your profits from the bots. And if we go back to Binance bot trading, there's a clear visualization what the bot is actually doing. And as you can see, there's a bunch of limit orders right here and right here as well. So what the bot is doing as the price goes down, it either buys or sells. And when the price goes up, it buys or sells again, depending depending if the bot is shorting or longing. So you can see that the price has crossed four limit orders today, which should mean that I have four successful trades today. But anyways guys, that about wraps up the video. If you have any more questions about bot trading, please leave the questions in the comments down below. Like the video, subscribe to the channel to help me with the YouTube algorithm thingy. See you in the next video. Bye.